Good morning, Baldwin. My name's Bella Kenny, and I'm here with Dee Harms, Kevin Sheehan, and Ethan Weehunt. Today is Friday, May 10th, and here are your morning announcements. But first, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please be seated for the rest of today's announcements. The impossible question is, on average, you were in your 30s the last time you do this. What is it? Stay tuned to find out. Attention, all students required to take the Keystone Biology exam, room assignment lists are posted outside the guidance office, main office, cafeteria, and library. Please consult the list to determine your testing room. The Keystone Biology exam will be administered Monday, May 14th, and Wednesday, May 16th, starting at 7.45 a.m. and ending at 9.20 a.m. A reminder to all students who are not required to take the test. We will be operating on a two-hour delay schedule. Good luck to the students taking Keystones. There will be a meeting for all students wishing to run for junior or senior class officer in the 2018-2019 school year in room 110 right after school on Monday, May 14th. <coughs> if you're unable to attend, see Dr. Harold, class of 2019, or Mr. Deemer, class of 2020, to receive the necessary campaign applications Many will enter, few will win. May 14th is the second annual video film festival. Come to see the finest filmmakers Baldwin has to offer from 6.30 to 8.30 in the auditorium. Today, we'll be having a brief meeting after the school to put the finishing touches on for Monday. On Friday, May 18th, the National Honor Society is turning BHS into the ultimate escape room experience to benefit the Foundation for Suicide Prevention. Choose one of the 11 rooms designed by students with themes ranging from chemistry to music to vines. Each room lasts around 30 minutes and admission costs $5 per person. To sign up for a room in time, use the form on the NHS website. It will also be posted on the NHS Twitter feed. Walk-ins will be accepted at the door if rooms are available. Now over to Ethan for the weather. Ethan? Thanks, Dee. Er, thanks. Uh, uh, today we have a high of 70 and a low of 56 with a 15% chance of rain. Over the weekend, we'll be approaching the 80s and sunny weather throughout. Now back over to Dee for the rest of the morning announcements. Thanks, Ethan. Attention seniors, it's time to pick up those letters you wrote to yourself at the end of freshman year. See your ninth grade English teacher before school or in between classes. Mrs. Merman's students should see Mrs. Barno. The Scott Hirsch Memorial Scholarship for a nursing student who will attend the nursing program at CCAC or California University of Pennsylvania is due by May 20th. Also, the blood drive scholarship, scholarship deadlines are coming soon. Did you know you can apply for two of the three scholarships even if you didn't give blood? Did you know you could apply for all three if you've given blood or volunteered during the blood drives? All scholarship entries are due May 11th. Go to counseling, counselingdhs.weebly.com for a full description of the scholarships. You can see Mr. Hall for the information on these scholarships that are all due back to the guidance office. Now over to Kevin for the sports announcements. Kevin? Thanks, Dee. The boys lacrosse team defeated Plump last night with a score of, of 9-3. to three. In other sports news, the Winnipeg Jets defeated the Predators last night. The Western and Eastern Conference Finals are all set up now, but who cares about the, about, because the Pens aren't in it anyway. Now back over to Bella for the rest of the morning announcements. Thanks, Kevin. Today's lunch is steak and queso cheese hoagie with your choice of milk. Today's weird holiday is Twilight Zone. And the answer to the impossible question of, on average, you were in your 30s the last time you do this, is have a birthday party. That's all for the morning announcements. Make it a great day or not. The choice is always yours. Mr. Trap here. My favorite movie is Les Miserables. My hobbies are singing and going out to restaurants. And an interesting fact about myself is that I've never broken any bones. I have gotten stitches from a cut resulting from a butter knife. 